Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is one that is very impromptu. Um, Persona Cosmetics is launching a new palette tomorrow. It's August 7th when I'm filming it. They're launching it tomorrow, August 8th. And I have had like a little crush on Persona Cosmetics for quite a while now. I got a chance to try out the brand um, last winter um, and I just totally fell in love with their formula. I fell in love with Sona and her husband and the whole team. I just, I really, really like this brand and I really want to support them on their new launch. But since I knew that I was going to be ordering directly from their website, I wanted to grab maybe one, maybe two more products, but I'm having a really hard time deciding what those products should be. So you guys know what time it is. It's time to declutter my Persona Cosmetics cart. Um, as always, this lovely video idea was inspired by Sarah Rose, so I'll of course link her channel down below. If you guys aren't really sure what I mean by decluttering my cart, I just mean that we're going to go through the items that I have in my cart right now, what's really grabbing my attention, and kind of weed out the ones that I don't want to get until I whittle down my order to exactly what I want. I'm not actually going to order everything and like when I'm done filming this video like I normally do. I am going to wait until tomorrow, but it launches at like, I think it's 11 o'clock my time. Um, so of course I'm going to be at work. So I thought I would do this the night before, get everything set and ready and then hit order the next day. So without further ado, let's hop into it. So I am going to start my little screen recording right here, um, three, two, one, go, <laughs> as my screen is saying, so I can match it up with kind of what I'm saying so you guys can see what I'm doing as I kind of talk you through it. So I did already kind of go through their website and throw some things in my cart. Obviously, I don't have this palette in my cart yet um, because it hasn't launched yet. So let's just pop over my cart. So I have the 24-hour waterproof eyeliner in the shade Bronze, the Phoenix Matte Liquid Lipstick, the Laguna Highlighter, the Nude Lip Gloss Trio, and the Coral Lip Gloss. Oh, you know what? I also really quick want to add the Peach Lip Gloss because that's also one that I'm listing over and I don't want to leave any out in this little video. So I would kind of like to spend around 50 to 55 ish dollars. The palette retails for $42, but I was actually spinning the wheel that pops up when you go onto this website um, and I got a 20% off code, which was so awesome. So if the code applies to that, it should end up being around $36. And free shipping is $40, but I already kind of thought, you know, I'm going to have to hit the $50 limit. So I'm okay with spending a little bit more than that. Um, so I'm kind of going to look at these items as if they are already 20% off price wise. So like I said, we're at 36 right now. We have about $14 to spend. Each of these items is about 14 ish dollars, even with the discount. So let's dive in and start kicking things out. Um, first, I guess we'll just kind of go through. The first one that I added to my cart was this gorgeous peach gloss. I am dying to try one of these glosses. I've heard that the formula is just fantastic. I think this peach color is beautiful and a gorgeous everyday one that I would really get a lot of use out of. And I just really like it. I think they're all really, really stunning. This peach shade is in this nude lip gloss trio, which I'm also kind of lusting after. Um, this trio is as a, at a little bit of a discounted price. It's $48 instead of, or I'm sorry, it's $36 instead of the $48 that it would be um, if you bought the glosses individually. I'm clicking around like a crazy person. Um, and then 20% off of that would be like seven bucks, so it would be 29. So uh, as much as I love all of these glosses, I mean, look at these swatches, you guys, they're gorgeous. Like, I feel like I could even pull off that dark one. It doesn't look to be super intensely pigmented. Probably don't need this whole trio. I have lip glosses coming out the wazoo, so I'm gonna get this trio out of my cart right now. Sadly, my heart is breaking. Um, so now let's take a look at the coral lip gloss. This is the other one that I'm very, very intrigued by because I'm obsessed with coral, if you guys didn't know. Um, I feel like this is a really gorgeous, really beautiful kind of summery lip gloss and I don't, don't quote me on this, but I feel like I don't have a coral lip gloss in my collection. And I think this tone is so beautiful. I know I wouldn't really get a whole lot of use out of it in the coming months, but for the next like maybe month and a half while it's still warm outside, I would love this so very much. So we're gonna keep that in for now. I also put in the Laguna highlighter. I have been hearing people rave about these highlighters for such a long time. I did put a buy ban on highlighters, so I probably shouldn't buy this one, but it's on sale for $19 plus the 20% off 
would make it like 15-ish dollars, which is almost perfect. That's kind of what I need to hit that mark that I was aiming for. Laguna is that top swatch right there. It's that really pretty like ivory shade. Um, I think it's so gorgeous. I think it would be really nice on my fair skin, but honestly, it's not that unique to my collection. So I don't really know about this one. I'm still making up my mind about it. Next, we have the Phoenix Matte Liquid Lipstick. I'm also not supposed to be buying liquid lipsticks, but this one, I don't know why this one is calling to me so much. This one's described as a warm, vibrant, fiery red with orange undertones. And I just love it. I don't even wear red lips that often. I don't wear red oranges that often, but for some reason, this is calling to me. Oh, you guys, I don't wanna take this out of my cart. Oh, uh, because it's only, it's like $13 with the discount code. No, I think I have to take it out, you guys, because I think I have a Maybelline Superstay that's in a very, very similar shade, so I don't really need this one. I'm very sad now. Um, and I also put in the 24-hour waterproof bronze eyeliner. I have their, I think it's like their berry liner or something like that, and I think it's beautiful. It goes onto the waterline, really full color. It smudges really nicely along the lash line, um, and I don't have a bronze eyeliner in my collection. I don't believe. Um, here's that bronze shade right there, kind of swatched out. I think this would be really complimentary to my blue eyes, but I did just buy all those ColourPop liners. I don't think I have a shade that matches this one exactly, but I probably have a similar one, so... Probably don't need this one. I'm sad. I'm taking that one out of my cart too. And then we have the peach lip gloss, which is again that first shade that we talked about. Since I don't have the nude trio, I would feel okay about buying this one. It's just a really gorgeous gloss that I know I would get a lot of use out of every day. I think it's really pretty. I think it's a tone that I would really enjoy and that would go with a lot of different looks. Okay, that's a maybe. So it's between Laguna highlighter, peach lip gloss, coral lip gloss, and of course the palette, but I can't add that to my cart right now. Oh, what do I do? What do I do? What do I do? I just, I love this coral gloss, you guys. I think it's so beautiful. It's so pretty, but then again, I'm like, I can only wear this. Okay, not that I can only wear this for that long. You can wear makeup for however long you want, no matter what the season is. You can rock whatever lip color you want. I just feel like I would get more use out of the peach one but again I have I feel like I have similar shades in my collection to that peach one I mean it's just kind of an everyday smooth gloss so I think I'm gonna go with the coral gloss for now now we have to decide between the Laguna highlighter and the coral gloss all right here's where we're digging deep you guys we're digging deep into this little investigation so i'm gonna actually look at some reviews on both of these products the highlighter has five stars and 24 reviews um all these are really really positive this one says i'm in love with the laguna highlighter so beautiful it looks like i'm naturally glowing go into the light hand because it can have a blinding effect i really like a highlighter that can do both honestly yeah these are all really really awesome really positive reviews and I feel like I don't have that many highlighters that are really that bright for my skin tone. I feel like I have to search and search and search for really, really light, really bright highlighters. Let's look at the reviews on the Coral Lip Gloss. This one only has two reviews. It is a newer product. Lip glosses are amazing, not sticky, and the colors are beautiful. Very nice texture, soft, not sticky. The color is more red than coral. All right, I think what it's going to come down to is that I can still get this gloss on Ulta and they were just on sale like a couple weeks ago. So I'm sure they'll go on sale again at Ulta, but that highlighter is no longer available at Ulta. They actually only have like the medium shade of their highlighter on Ulta. So I think I'm going to get the Laguna highlighter along with the palette. I'm so excited, you guys. So that was a very short declutter my cart with me. Usually these videos are much longer. I really hope that you guys enjoyed this little declutter my cart with me. I know it was a really short one, but Persona Cosmetics doesn't really have too many products. They're still a relatively new brand and they take a lot of time and put a lot of effort into all the products that they release, which I really do like because I feel like everything that they put out is really well formulated, really high quality. So yeah, I hope you guys really enjoyed this video. Um, I will be sure to include these products in an upcoming haul. I think I haven't done a haul video in a long time, kind of intentionally. I was getting kind of bored of them, but I placed an order with Ulta. My Sydney Grace order is coming in. 
I've, I foresee a haul brewing in the future. So thank you so much for watching. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe if you enjoyed this video. I will link my other declutter my cart with me videos down below if you did enjoy this style of video and I hope I see you guys in my next one. Bye!